Hi guys! The question is if you should wear a mask in the Philippines and the answer is yes. Let me tell you why in this video. The answer is yes and it's not just because of the coronavirus going around at the moment it's also for your own safety from the air pollution and also if you're ill uh, so you stop spreading the germs to other people I mean it's shocking that I didn't think about it myself before you know we've been told in in Europe or even in US when you cough or sneeze to do it in your uh, in your arm or cover it up with a napkin which is actually better than the arm but to be honest and this applies to anywhere if you travel in Southeast Asia or in your home country you should always have a spare a face mask uh, on you because if you're ill uh, or if you're in a big city you you should just put it on in big cities you don't want to get the um, irritated uh, throat from the all the pollutions you know when it's scratching you on full nose of uh, dust yeah that's where the surgical fa face mask do come in handy and for the coronavirus uh, yes, it's very important to wear a face mask, but make sure to get the right one because the normal surgical ones, uh, they do not protect you from catching it. They only protect from spreading it if you're already infected. So to get yourself uh, protected from the coronavirus or any serious other epidemic uh, virus that there might be, uh, hopefully not, fingers crossed, uh, get the respiratory uh, face mask that fully covers uh, your nose, mouth and cheeks so the air, uh, there is no gaps in between the masks and your face because that's how the bacteria gets through and also uh, do not wear the face mask whichever one it says if the surgical or the respiratory for too long because one <laughs> it gets super hot in it and two you eventually run out of air yeah the they do not allow as much oxygen to go through the respiratory masks do have filters on which is great you can wear them for longer for like a few hours but not a whole day uh, some people have get even like lung problems from wearing masks for too long so only wear it if you need it and because the surgical masks are super cheap like you can get a pack of 100 um, for a few quid for a few pounds that at least was a few months ago before we went traveling now because of the coronavirus it might be more expensive or really hard to get and here is example of us trying to get some masks in Philippines. We struggled uh, to get masks. We bought like last ones um, in supermarkets, the material ones. And then there was limitation on uh, how many you can get in a pharmacy. Okay, you might have heard of the coronavirus. This is why we're wearing the mask. We stocked up the bit. We got a few of the disposable ones as well from a pharmacy, the only place that still has them. But there are limits. You can only buy five per person in a day. Yeah, so <laughs> at least they had some and we got some. I mean, I'm hoping these will be good because you can wash these uh, but it's it's not fitted perfectly it doesn't have the wire so I might have to modify it with these ones yeah it's even coming up when I talk like slightly shifting down oh here we go you can see my nose already yeah ah so stressful with this virus oh my god so yeah this one was 35 each we got uh, four, uh, four of those and then the disposable ones were five uh, pesos each. It's still a 
because you know the prices. Back in back in England, we actually bought like pack of 100 for pound fifty, and now here it's so much more expensive. I don't know if it's because of this virus now or just because they sell them per, per piece. Yeah, but we're gonna protect ourselves. Well, you need to. You don't. You don't want to catch this crap or any other pollutions from the around the area. But you can still have fun even when you're traveling with the coronavirus happening or air pollution. It's the best food we tried in Philippines so far, which is a surprise. Yay! <laughs> 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 next one, next one, wait, wait. a big ball like we could probably fit 30 people here <laughs> You still find those little secret places that no one knows about or that are not too crowded. So yeah, don't be afraid of traveling to, to countries that are not much affected by coronavirus. Okay. Nice! And where are all the boats? Where are all the people? I think all the boats are on the Iceland Hopping Tours. About locals, how they uh, go about wearing masks or not wearing them. majority of them that are on the road wear masks because there is so much pollution from the tricycles, scooters, the constant barbecues that are happening and also they burn quite a bit of rubbish so face masks are very helpful. Also, some of the roads in Philippines are not fully developed, uh, fully paved. So it's sand, sand road, pretty much really dusty. And that's uh, when face mask saves you and glasses, yes. <laughs> so you don't have to close your eyes. <laughs> And to finish off, where can you buy face masks? So you can get them in pharmacies, uh, some supermarkets even have them online if you can find any. But at the moment, it's pretty hard to find the proper face masks that cover all your face. Um, so that's the struggles that we've got at the moment. But luckily we're in a country that is not too much affected by this coronavirus. And fingers crossed it will stay that way. Let me know in comments how you're getting on with your travels. And thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye!